in August of 2011, both YouTube and Vimeo deleted thousands of Destiny videos as they were regarded as spam containing commercially deceptive content and promoting a multi-level marketing scheme. Is Destiny running commercially deceptive scams? Let's take a closer look at how the finances of the Destiny group are managed. There does not appear to be an actual registered legal company or business with the name Destiny. If there is, then it is certainly not on the web. Destiny's financial transactions are dealt with by a bank account with the name Equal Life Foundation. The Equal Life Foundation has a website, equallife.org, but it has almost no content. What is the Equal Life Foundation and what does it actually do? At the destinyequalmoney.org website, it states that the Equal Life Foundation is a non-profit organization. It is referred to as such by the members of the Destiny group in their videos and blogs. A name search at the Companies and Intellectual Copyright Commission of South Africa website for the Equal Life Foundation reveals that the Equal Life Foundation is in fact registered as a non-profit company. A non-profit company is defined as a company incorporated for public benefit or other object relating to one or more cultural or social activities or communal or group interests, the income and property of which are not distributable to its incorporators, members, directors, officers or persons relating to any of them. ECAF.com is one of the main websites run by the Equal Life Foundation. At ECAF.com it states that all trademarks and logos of ECAF.com are registered and copyrighted to the Equal Life Foundation. ECAF.com is a commercial online business and sells hundreds of MP3s and ebooks with such titles as I'm a Destonian, Reptilians, The Design and Creation of DNA, how I was able to hear the destiny message and the quantum existence of the elephant. The complete Reptilians series costs over 1500 euros, which is over 2000 US dollars, 1300 UK pounds. ECAF products are sold via the ECAF affiliate program. The website states that you can make up to 50% on every product you sell. They try and get people to join this program, set up their own shop and sell Destonian beliefs in ebook and mp3 form to keep on passing on. People think they can make money off this and every time they earn some money by selling a product, a large amount of that money goes towards the Destonian organization. This is a very easy way of them spreading their beliefs and ideas, pseudoscience and new age mythology, and also making a great amount of money. The large part of the income made by ECAF products goes to the Equal Life Foundation. The rest is distributed to its members. All finances of Destiny are run by the Equal Life Foundation. The members of Destiny are in effect the members, officers or representatives of the Equal Life Foundation. They pass on and sell and make money from sales of ECAF products and yet the Equal Life Foundation is supposedly a non-profit company. The ECAF.com affiliate program as it is described by the Equal Life Foundation appears to show that it is distributable to its incorporators, members, directors officers or persons relating to any of them. The Equal Life Foundation also takes payments for the Destiny I process, a series of online courses in life skills and self-mastery, which are sold in the form of a multi-level marketing scheme. 
The copyright of the Destiny I process belongs to the Equal Life Foundation. The website states, Standing in the role of a recruiter and or a buddy to someone qualifies you to receive a percentage from each course fee your recruit pays. You can recruit a maximum number of 10 people that choose to be agents. These will grow your downline and your income. The income is earned every month from every single person your downline that is participating and paid the monthly course fee. The income is accumulated in your account and you can withdraw the money at any time if you have more than 100 euros accumulated. The income made on the sale of the Destiny I process courses appears to be income that is distributed to the Equal Life Foundation. Incorporators, members, directors, officers or any persons relating to them. Obviously, this is a breach of the idea of them being a non-profit company. If they're a non-profit company, there's not meant to be a distribution of wealth from the company to incorporate as members, directors, officers, or any persons relating to them. ECAF and Destiny I process may be group interests. However, there is no evidence that they are of public benefit. It seems they are a private business concern aimed at potential customers into hearing interdimensional messages from reptilians, Atlanteans, dead people, and so on. Does the Equal Life Foundation exist in order to manage the finances of the private profit-making business concerns of the Destiny Group and exists for no other purpose than to coordinate these profit-making enterprises? Could it be said that the Equal Life Foundation non-profit company is a tax dodge for the Destiny Group? Because obviously if it distributes to its members it cannot truly claim to be a non-profit company. If it is truly a legitimate non-profit company, then why is it using affiliate marketing and multi-level marketing to make it money for its members? I invite people at this point to bring forward their explanation. If you're associated with, as a member or representative, you're welcome to leave a comment below, you're welcome to leave a video response and provide proper explanation for the activities relating to the Equal Life Foundation. Otherwise, the information in this video can be used by anyone concerned to file a fraud report with the Companies and Intellectual Copyright Commission of South Africa. The links will be below. I recommend you check them out.